the second time I've seen that star. We're lost, aren't we? The scenic route? Green! I don't think so. No, you haven't put on weight. Are you sure the candidate has to have these requirements? Maureen, we're talking about the new emperor of the universe here. Almost. Almost. Come on! Yes! Oh no, the weird's got Harris. He's been possessed by the embarrassing public display monster. Shh! 18th hole. If he avoids the sand trap, he'll be on the green in two. He's playing mental golf? I miss Caddy. <gasps> Sliced it into the trees, chipped out with a wedge in three under par. We scored a 68 on the back nine, and my birthday's on Saturday. Saturday? Why didn't you say something? Oh, I, I, I did. Last week when you mentioned Friday, which is right next to Saturday, I did that coughing thing, you know. <laughs> Sorry, our fault. My folks are having me and my sisters out for a pizza night, and, well, I was just thinking that maybe... Was that an invite for birthday pizza? I kind of wanted it to be a friend's thing, too. I'd love to come. Cool. Great, great, great. Harris, you need to get lighter imaginary golf clubs, because I am beat. He's so sweet. You know. No. No, you don't understand. I know exactly what you're thinking, and whatever it is, it's a bad idea. No, listen. If that's how happy he is with just two friends, think how happy he'll be with lots and lots of friends. He's only got us friends. Right now. But by his birthday, he may have a few more. Harris, you can't make someone popular. It just doesn't work that way. Are you sure about this? No, Mom. No, Mom. No, I'm not criticizing your analysis. Yes, I do think you're qualified. And yes, I'm sorry I snapped. But I am the captain. Okay? Set a course for Earth. Aren't we some ancient? Harris Pembleton, you just made an enemy of the wrong god. For as long as you exist, I will set forces to inflict chaos upon life. Doofus, I'm not gonna talk to. Point right. Let's catch up Saturday. Saturday? Hugo's party. Draper High royalty only. Bear told you time and place, right? Yeah. You, you, no, sure he did. No, because if he yeah, didn't... No, I, he did. He okay. did. Okay. Hey. Let's keep this A-list, okay? Not a word to the plebs. Yeah? What? So, Saturday? Yeah. Should be good. The thing. You mean the thing or the thing? Hugo's thing. Yeah. It's gonna be wild. <laughs> Been there. So you're going? I wouldn't miss it. Yeah, I might swing by. Did you locate the candidate with all the requirements yet? <laughs> Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> 
a human. Could you possibly narrow it down just a tiny fraction? You want some catering? I can whip you up a parcel of hummus sculptures. You know, Mount Olympus, Parthenon, the pyramids. Whole Greek shebang, huh? Are you uh, talking about what I think you are? <laughs> Probably not. Uh, it's OK, thanks. Catering's already taken care of. Hugo's birthday bash. Yeah, there's some stuff being flown in from New York on, on Saturday. Draper High A-list. And maybe, maybe some college guys. College guys? Uh, it's nothing special. It's probably the biggest of the year. Let's make the jump to light speed. Me now. Uh -huh. No, no, I am not rushing you. I just happen to believe that on our priorities list, finding the new emperor of the universe goes above shopping. Don't use that tone with me. Okay, crank it up a notch. <laughs> No, no, me first. Hugo is having this huge party. Everyone is going. The whole school is... You did this, didn't you? <laughs> thank you. Thank you. You're making a big mistake. He's going to be so happy. Hugo doesn't want a big party. He's going to love it. Harris, it'll never work. <laughs> hey, Hugo. Hey. Hi, Hugo. Hello. Hugo, my man! Hey guys. So, lots of people being really friendly? Don't think so. People who might want to say happy birthday. Oh, that reminds me. Everything's a go for Pizza Saturday, right after my sisters get their braces removed. All your sisters? Screws up TV reception. My dad can't watch the fishing channel. Hugo, filter, huh? Filter. Picture this. The birthday boy, surrounded by friends and admirers, all wanting to heap gifts and affection on him. Huh? Wouldn't that be great? Nah. You two and a cheesy crust is all a guy needs. I bet your party is gonna be the best ever. Oh, it'll be intense. I bet it'll go till the AM. I don't know. My sisters are usually in bed by midnight, and they had to start brushing at 10. Oh, don't worry. We'll, we'll keep the party fire burning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You want to come to my birthday pizza? Mm -hmm. Dude, mm -hmm. we're already there. <laughs> well, uh, well... Mm -hmm. <laughs> cool. <laughs> mm -hmm. I gotta go. Um, Fenella and Harris are waiting for me. <laughs> if you start breaking when I tell you, you don't need emergency thrusters. <laughs> well, Earth. Okay, uh, let's get a transporter lock on the new emperor. Oh, wait! Is that our figurehead to the universe? I don't think so. Can I bring you your glasses? And you could have got a more impressive transporter. Babe. Like at your party, you know? Uh, are, are your sisters gonna be there? Uh, older sisters. Well, it's not that great. I mean, sharp nails, wet stuff always hanging in the bathroom. And somebody's always spraying something. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Bring on the party. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Can we possibly get a lock on the new emperor before you go in for your trillion mile service? 
Pendleton. Uh. Hey, guys. Hugo. Nope, I'm still here. Okay. Got to work on my angry walk. Are you sure you've got the lock on him now? Maureen, not a sticky little kid who... universe to possess the necessary qualities to be emperor of said universe. You can say it better. By all means, go ahead. You are the guy that waves out the window when we fly by. You have many important duties and obligations, treaties to sign, banquets to host. I'm having a party. It's my birthday on Saturday. Hey, every day is your birthday when you're Emperor of the Universe. They're gonna give you tributes and, and, and stuff like you won't believe. The smaller worlds club together to get something big. So I get a lot of presents? <laughs> You'll be writing so many thank you notes you think you're dying, which is what finished the last Emperor. Mabel. <laughs> This is a spaceship, isn't it? Uh -huh. State of the art. Zero to light speed in an instant. Equally at home in crowded nebulae as the infinite reaches of outer space. What's this? Death Ray, don't touch. You have a crowded agenda, your highness. Every Tom, Dick, and Rocky <laughs> wants a piece of you. Well, I am the emperor. <laughs> Ooh, thank you. When meeting an alien, do not shake anything. You could be declaring war or <laughs> proposing marriage. Ooh, your highness is due to be opening a space smart in a galaxy nearby. Great. Short journey, say 15 light speed minutes. Oh, man, I can't. I got math. But you're the Emperor of the Universe, Your Highness. But I can't miss math. Mr. Rajowski gives me this look. It makes me whimper. Well, you know, why don't we open the Space Mart, grab a pizza, and then blot out the lonely scum with the death ray, Your Highness? You so don't want to do that. Okay, okay, here's the deal. Beam down, math class. Beam up, space smart. Excuse me. Your Highness. Yeah. He ignored me. He probably didn't see you. Or his ego was in the way. <laughs> He's our friend. He likes you. You could be right. <laughs> okay, you're right. I am right. I'm probably overreacting. Come on, Harris. It's Hugo. Our Hugo, he wouldn't act like that. Yeah, he was probably looking for his mental golf balls or something. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Hugo, math class, remember, play dead and Rajkowski won't bite. Hugo? It's your highness. We need to have some issues cleared because Harry. Don't touch me. You're not supposed to. Insensitive little... Okay, Mr. Short, the oil-stained rag you regularly present in place of your math homework. I haven't got it. If you can come up with an excuse I haven't heard, I'll let you off. I left it in my spaceship. <laughs> I'm Emperor of the Universe. You can kneel now.
You are so brave. Total hero -ness. I thought Rajkowski was gonna have a meltdown. You've gotta tell that Emperor story at the party. Party's off for you guys, sorry. Huh? Strictly VIP. What are you talking about? We're A-list. A-list. There's a whole other alphabet you guys haven't even heard of. I thought... Oh, man. Where did that come from? You think you know someone? Then bam. It's all over. Hey, man. Come on. It's you and me. You and me? We are us! Okay! Yes! Let's go work out! Yes! Hugo, your behavior is unacceptable. Excuse me, Harris. Hugo, listen. I'm open and accepting. I understand what's going on with you. Growing up, all sorts of pressures and tensions. I just want you to know that you're an idiot! Hugo, I no longer want to be your friend. Okay. No, no. Our friendship is officially terminated. Okay. And I'm returning all the stuff you gave me. I've got to get back to my spaceship, okay? Including the mosquito repellent that we bought for the camping trip that we're not going to take. You're taking your stuff back? Yeah. I wasn't really giving them back. I was trying to snap you out of this. But now I'm really going to give them back. So give them back again so I can give them back and mean it. I have a death ray. Oh, stop it. I am the emperor of the universe. You're not really popular. I made you popular by spreading rumors so everyone would want to come to your birthday party. Harris, I'm the only one in the universe who has all the qualities you need to be the emperor. You got it? Hugo, you are not the emperor of the universe, and you don't have a spaceship! Any calls? What's that doing here? Maureen, you did it again. It's Maureen. She's the one that chose me. And this is the guy that tells me stuff. They kind of a thing going on. Your Highness, either make the kid your minion, or he gets beamed back, because we have a space mark to open. I'm sorry, minion? <laughs> no, 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 no. You want to be my minion? OK, let's take a look at this a second. OK, I'll spell it out for you. Hugo Short, Emperor of the Universe. Yeah. I'll give it you one more time. Yeah. Hugo Short, Emperor of the Universe. Yeah. Now, doesn't that sound slightly weird to you, huh? No. The weird is interfering with my life. You're just an innocent bystander. This is not about you, Harris. I'm the special one this time. Emperor of the Universe beats English kid with a curse. Doesn't it, Maureen? Yeah. She says yes. Okay, right about now I'll be storming out, but I'd explode in the vacuum of deep space, so beam me back. No problem. I'm going home in a little bit. Uh, excuse me, Your Highness, but I don't think so. The Space Mart is 15 minutes at light speed. Which means you're going to be gone for exactly... Uh, about a thousand years. A thousand years? Yes. Not 15 minutes. Correct. I don't think I want to be emperor anymore. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Hugo resigned, so uh, thanks for having us, and uh, love the spaceship. We'll be going now. Okay, beam us down. <laughs> it doesn't work like that. You're either an emperor or a dead emperor. <laughs> I think I'm going to throw up. Can I use the space bathroom? Right. Say goodbye to your planet, boys. Hold on. This isn't the fastest route. What are you doing, Maureen? I'm gonna beam us back. This is impossible to work. You have to be way more evolved than we Earthlings and have one of those huge pulsating skulls. Or I could just press the button that says beam down. Yeah. Hi. Don't forget to wash your hands. Hey, look, 
I'm sorry. Yeah. About everything. Me too. Good. You small-brained, irresponsible little buck. Your Highness. Okay. Oh, boy. When I said being emperor was for life, I miss <laughs> ah! ah! Uh, look, Hugo's a great guy, but he's not really emperor material. Hey, I could be... Hugo, don't interrupt me while I'm trying to save you. My Maureen has searched the universe. His Highness is the only one who... ...possesses the right requirements. I have organizational skills, leadership qualities. I have my own laminator. Take me instead. Do you have puppy dog eyes and a sweet disposition? Well... Can you see the good in everyone and play only two notes on the harmonica? <laughs> he can't even play one note. Still trying to save you here, Hugo. <clears throat> Do you have... Do you have four older sisters? And do you have a womb so fertile you will bear countless litters of emperor offspring? What was that last one? <clears throat> and then he said he was divorcing Maureen and transported himself back. I don't think he meant it. I bet they've made up by now. He was rather reasonable once we'd explained the whole Earth Boys not having babies thing. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, it's my, uh... <clears throat> oh, your birthday. I can't. You know, I got a, a thing. This is not good. My parents need me at the restaurant. Sorry. Next year, definitely. 